faces from India Inc. and ask them about their expectations from the government's demonetization move and exactly what impact they have seen on their businesses. Here are some of the key reactions. Ensuring that farmers do not compromise with the rubber crop because of demonetization. And that's, that, that to me is the most important. Beyond that, I don't think the demonetization is going to have an effect on farm income. Uh, the, the, the sort of our system will correct itself and uh, we'll be back, back to normal. So the only concern that I have is next four months. Right now the industry is down and the sentiments are, 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 are not uh, sort of conducive to people coming out and buying a vehicle unless they absolutely have to have it. Everybody is in a wait and watch mode. We have a huge uh, black economy or uh, parallel economy, so to say, cash economy. So uh, I think uh, the, what the Prime Minister is doing is to switch, uh, which is a very tough job, but uh, to switch uh, from a, a parallel economy to, to digital economy to, to mainstream economy. What every industry is doing is that we are uh, issuing uh, POS, uh, these uh, swipe machines, to our dealers and, uh, and trying to digitalize. The existing portfolio is much higher than the new accretion. So overall, it will have positive impact for the NPS valuation. We have about 1.4 lakh subscriber. I think the subscriber base should be anywhere between 30 to 33 percent, uh, the increase in the subscriber base. And as for the AUM, is con the contribution is concerned. As I have said, during the last five years, it was 60 percent plus. So I expect it to be in that order. Meanwhile, we also spoke to 